Hey everyone, just want to give you an update what we'll be working on this month. So let me play. And this is a shadow spell. And the first part of it, I think it looks uh, pretty good, which is the cast, which is this. And then we go to attack and I think it's lacking a bit. So I'm going to try to improve it in the second part because this is going to be a two part video. And also I'm going to try to implement a enemy character being affected by this spell. Okay, so that's uh, tier one. Uh, you can access this um, on Patreon or on 1mafx.com. And tier two uh, on 1mafx.com, we, uh, we will focus on looping smoke from Embergen. And this is our first uh, dive into the Embergen. Uh, this is what I've got so far. We've got a looping smoke, we've got some um, custom erosion on it rather than just simple fade. And that's gonna be two part as well. In the first part we're gonna just do this looping simulation in Embergen, try to optimize it as much as possible, apply various uh, material techniques to it, including the erosion at the end. And in the second part we're gonna try to do simulation that is a low in density and we're going to try to combine those. So as you can see here, you're going to have uh, sharp shapes and very defined shapes as well. But towards the end, we're going to lerp between two simulations. And hopefully here we're going to have a bit more wispy and soft uh, smoke when we're going to do that uh, lerp. And we will also be focusing on optimizing this because we don't want this to be and very performance heavy. So we're gonna look onto the various techniques, how we can combine textures and minimize the memory and overdraw cost for this. All right, so hope you're gonna enjoy this one. Tier one, the shadow spell, tier two on one mfx.com. We start diving into the Ember Gen and we're gonna do the looping smoke first. All right, thank you so much for your support and I hope you're gonna enjoy those two tutorials.